Hello guys, I'm Wizio Racer, and in this week's video we continue with the largest engines. And the largest engines are often 12, 14 or 16 cylinder large. And the reason being the simplicity. Because more cylinders add complexity and maintenance is harder. So you get the point. But we are engine geeks and we like things which are not usual and stand out of the crowd. So this time we speak about engines that have 18 or more cylinders. There are many 18 cylinder engines, but this Isota Frashini SO750 is a very interesting piece of unit. This is an Italian engine series produced since 1930s and the SO series was designed as an inline 6, V12 or W18 engine. It is liquid cooled with 4 valves per cylinder and has double overhead cams operated by shaft and gear driven by crankshaft. They were variants with natural aspiration or supercharger. They used chrome manganese for engine block and aluminum for heads. It was mostly used in aircrafts, but in 1950 CRM was handed over this project, which continued and created also a diesel version of the W18, mostly used in marine applications. This next one may be familiar to you. This is Bristol Centaurus, one of the most successful aircraft piston engines in World War II. Compared to the SO single stage supercharger, this one had a two stage supercharger but using sleeve valves with four parts per cylinder. This one was air cooled with twin rows per nine cylinders being 18 cylinder. There were 34 versions of it, between 2000 up to 2600 rpm, experimentally with up to 3000 rpm. If you are enjoying this content, a subscribe would be massively appreciated. Many of you are not subscribed, so please consider that. MTU is known for stationary engines, and this 4000 series ranges from V8 up to V20, both in diesel and gasoline spark ignited versions. It is a 4 stroke engine with 4 overhead valves, twin turbos, and also intercooled. It can be started with a 24 volt starter or compressed air. It has been produced since 1997 with over 37,000 built for various industrial applications like railway. Detroit Diesel Series 71 is a very popular one, but one engine of the series is a rarity. A V24 engine, which is barely known because there are no specs on the internet nor the videos. It was built for marine applications and has quad turbos. There is a single custom built V24 made of two 12 V71s plined together, making over 3000 horsepower. Red Whitney R3460 Major Wasp is named after the volume in cubic inches, meaning this was over 71 litre engine 
one of the largest piston engines ever in four rows of cylinders, making it a 28-cylinder engine. It had a gear-driven centrifugal supercharger spinning up to 18,000 rpm and a dry sump oiling system. It was introduced at the end of the World War II and used afterwards with up to 18,000 examples built. Because of so many rows, the cooling was an issue and it required frequent cylinder replacements. The last one on this list is one ridiculously large engine and it is a 42 cylinder Zvezda M503 engine, a Russian built engine for marine applications. This is a liquid cooled 7 overhead cam engine with 7 inline 6 engines in one block, basically making it a radial 42. It has a massive weight of 5.4 tons mostly used in missile boats with three per vessel. It has a compound force induction, a turbo supercharger, depending on the RPM, it is either crank or exhaust driven. There is a custom tuned engine converted into a gasoline unit with custom heads, three spark plugs per cylinder, used for tractor pulling, making up to 10,000 horsepower. There are other versions of this engine, for instance the M504, which is a 56 cylinder, or a twin engine M507, 112 cylinder engine. Thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it and see you in the next one. Cheers!